Get wrecked, woman. Crap, now we have to catch up to Liara. I don't know how fast they ran. All right, she's obviously going quite fast. Where'd you go? Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have to fight a, my way through a bunch of these nerds again, aren't I? Look, it's fine. It is what it is. I expect it at this point. Especially in a situation where it doesn't really matter for me. Because I could just keep doing this all day long. I love it. It's so much fun playing the Vanguard. Okay, are we good? Are they all dead? Where'd the R go? Probably through the store. It's gonna, yeah, cinematic me. No, no, there it goes. It had to load it, apparently. This music is so epic. I just pulled one of those. I'm fine, by the way. Thanks for asking. <laughs> uh, take Garrus or Tally? Uh, Garrus. Garrus. Gotta take Garrus. Garrus, Liara, we're, we're going in. The OG crew. I mean, Tally was part of that, too. Come on, she's getting away. S something just feels right about Garrus on this one. Do I drive? Oh, I forgot about this. There she is. I forgot that I get to drive a car. Hang a right. No wait left. I'm on her. Thanks. I could spend squad Hang points. I don't I don't remember this at all. <laughs> I don't remember having a Coruscant chase. She's around the corner. Hurry, Shepard, we're losing We're not going into the construction site, are Oh goddess. Oh, yes we are. I don't. I don't actually know how to go I'm up or down. Escape with that data. I don't think I can. I just gotta. I just gotta chase her down. I wonder how much of this was inspired by the go, Star go, Wars go, prequels. Go, 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 go. I'm it, going. It feels like it was heavily inspired by. I mean, Coruscant's traffic, like oncoming traffic. A really we'll cool fine. <clears throat> idea. I suppose that's not necessarily unique either. You know, think She's like. dropping proximity charges. I noticed. Like Blade Runner, you know. <laughs> Blade Runner was definitely unique in that regard, having the big giant city with the flying cars and everything. Blade Runner was the She's original force. What kind of guns does this thing have? It's a taxi. It has a fare meter. Wonderful. Cool. Well, truck. I know. Truck. I know. <laughs> there we go. You're enjoying this. You know what? I am. This is fun. This is not. I don't remember this at all. A head-on collision at this speed. Yeah, I hear those can be bad for you. <laughs> is it? Was this in the original uh, layer of the Shadow Broker? Because I don't remember it Truck. in the slightest. Again. All right, just going this way, anyways. Watch out. If I jump onto her car, it's straight up Star Wars Episode 2. <laughs> Even the sounds are very reminiscent. It's definitely inspired by. Get me some damn backup. Well, your backups arrived. Not the kind that you wanted, though. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements. There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. They've blocked the door. Watch Man, this out. This is so cool. This is just so cool. <laughs> I don't remember it being this cool. For whatever reason, but I'll tell you what, I am I am in. I'm all in on this DLC right now. This is so much fun for me. <laughs> ah! 
Here's another thing to consider. Oh, hold on. What is your least favorite Star Wars movie? Because for me, without a shadow of a doubt, it's, it is Star Wars Episode Two. It's so bad. I died. I couldn't. It wouldn't let me cast anything. Um, yeah, Star Wars Episode Two is so bad. The acting. Come on, she can't have gotten far. It it was straight up one of the least immersive experiences I've ever had. You know, and Star Wars draws you in. It's immersive. It's really cool. And episode two, man, is so bad. I I wouldn't necessarily say it was the acting. It was definitely part of the acting, but it was also a bit of the direction there too. It wasn't the greatest. I don't know. Just hating Christensen when he was in that that first Star Wars movie of his. It just, I don't think, I don't know. It wasn't great. <laughs> there were cool things in episode two. You had like the whole thing on Kamino and Boba Fett, or not Boba Fett, but Jango Fett. And I guess Boba, but yeah, it was just like all that stuff was kind of cool. And then, my goodness gracious. Heck, even, even the bounty hunter on Coruscant was fun. And the, the chase scene was fun, but everything else was hard to watch. Very hard to watch. Can't target them. Which is unfortunate, because I think it could have been a great movie. Revenge of the Sith, though. Um, I don't know. Underrated, I would say. I, a lot of people don't like it. And I think, I think episode three is actually pretty high up there on the list blasphemous i know but it's it is pretty good all things considered in comparison to episode two especially i want to know in the comments what's your favorite star wars movie and what's your least favorite star wars movie it's a good timing too because the 20th anniversary of or not 20th wow that would have been a long time ago 10th anniversary of star wars the old republic launching was yesterday okay, are we done fighting all these nerds more of them seriously all right the worst part is it would it would constantly reset you throughout this if you died. I would start back from the beginning. That would suck. Bad checkpointing actually. Alright, are we good now? Are we finally kill them all? Alright, that'll do. Does that just give us a way in? Is that what that's supposed to do? Come on. We can climb over to get to Vizier's car. Cool, we can do that. Wait, climb over that? Or climb over this. It looks like climb over this. Yep, cool. This this works. <laughs> In fact, we're not just going to a car. We're going to like a whole apartment. She's begging. Which is cool and all, but I need to open this wall safe before I do anything. That'll do. How much money? 6,000, I'll take it. Happy with that, that's a good one. Can I go check out here too? Because obviously there's some things to pick up here. I just wanna make sure I'm not missing anything. Um, ooh, I saw something. Crap, where did it go? Oh, actually, you know what? It might've ended up, it, I think it was a door. Is there anything? Oh, there's a patron there. Hey, we're unharmed. We didn't see anything. Hold on. Hold on. I, I I saw that. I gotta go back. Oh, no, the car. The car's right there. Gotcha. We don't wanna... I don't wanna do that yet. I wanna go over here. Beg your pardon? What kind of hotel is this? Azure. It's a luxury resort with an exotic edge. Azure is slang for a part of the Asari body in some areas of Ilium. Where? Mainly the lower reaches, near the bottom. I meant where on the Asari body. <laughs> So did I. <laughs> that is beautiful. That was well done. I'll take it. I'll take it. Damage protection. Heck yeah. All right. Now we go this way. Now we go this way. Uh, also, a bit of Mass Effect news while we're on it. Um, the next Mass Effect game. A lot of blood. We have to be getting close. She's tough. I'll give her that much. She's a specter. It appears to be... Uh, being built in the Unreal 5 engine. They're hiring for people with Unreal 4 slash 5 engine experience. Unreal 5 being the, the latest engine that's not quite out yet. Um, 
you know, on the Epic website themselves, they suggest, you know, using five for like prototyping and stuff like that, or just learning the new, new cool stuff that they have in the new engine, because it is really cool. And personally, I have been learning it. I've, I've dove in and I'm certain to learn how that engine works. It's really, really cool. So yeah, next Mass Effect seems to be running on Unreal 5. Super exciting. But one thing to consider is Unreal is certainly pretty good for shooters. Vizier, it's over. And this was running in Unreal, so yeah. It's good to go back. Frostbite didn't really work out too well for Andromeda. It was a little hey, good. Hey, hey you. Come here. What's your name? M Mariana. Mariana, you want to live, don't you? Tell those people that you want to live. Please. Even if you get out of here, you'll lose your specter status. You attack the Trade Center. You think so? I think maybe Cerberus Terrace did that. Which story do you think the Council will believe? All you had to do was walk away. Now it gets ugly. Please, I have a son. A son? I hope he gets to see you again. I'm just gonna end up shooting I've her, aren't I? losing a parent is just horrific for children. Scars them for life. I'm going to end you, Fazir. It's okay, Liara. We'll handle it the usual way. You want Mariana's little boy to grow up without a mommy, Shepard? Thermal clips on the ground now. Power cells too. Sorry, gonna have to. Hiding behind a hostage, Fazir. No stomach for a real fight, just like an Asari. Drop the thermal clips, Shepard. You girls should really just stick to dancing. You know. Play to your strengths. <laughs> Drop the clip. Get her. I'm gonna kill your hostage, Bazir. And then I'm gonna show you how a real Spectre gets things done. You're bluffing. Damn. Now, Liara. Uh. Well, that's how you do it. We've been spotted. Hey. Girly girl, guess what? I got some news for you. It's called Shuck Under the Face. And Shuck Under the Face. The barrier's hard for me, apparently. But we're just gonna keep doing this over and over until we wipe her out. We got really thick barriers. <laughs> the seer's thick. But would you stop doing that? It's not funny. You're just teleporting around. Shot her in the butt. She's trying to get away from me. Oh, got her that time too. Here we go. Bam, bam. Right, where are you going now? Huh? Everybody's looking up there. Where'd she go? Oh, we got some drones coming in. I'm not I'm not too worried about the drones. Um, I'll let my dudes take care of that, because I'm not great with them. But I will. Can't go ahead and try to take care of everything else. Oh, wow. I whiffed really bad on that. Did I get it? Right, that one's dead. Oh, we got one more of these guys. Hey, engineer. <laughs> get wrecked. Where'd she go? Here she comes. All right. That, that was a good checkpoint. Saving. I saw. I like that. That's a cool boss fight. But it doesn't feel earned. I, I never got the impression that she was some super crazy overpowered character. Like she's a specter, sure, but did you see how quickly I killed uh, Saren? Like, come on now. This this seems a little, a little high on the difficulty spike. Uh, it's not even difficult. It's just, it's just a bullet sponge. Where'd she go? Can't target them. I like that I could just keep charging her over and over Watch out, Chuck. and over. Once once we get through the barrier there, everything's gonna go pretty quick. Bam. Oh, I couldn't nuke her. Get in here and kill Shepherd, damn it. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Maybe we do it on the next one. Well, I don't know. We're just tearing through her with little to no effort. I don't I don't really see the need. Um, okay, here, drones. One more. Bam. Like shooting drones in a skyscraper. 
Oh, can we heal? We're gonna need to heal ASAP. Bam. Oh, oh, didn't even reload yet. There we go. I'll finish you myself. I'm considering just nuking her. Yeah, I don't know. I do pretty high damage to her armor. It might be worth it to just hold out because then I'm not wasting my ammo for, as I mentioned before, future boss fight here. I don't know if I'm going to have enough heavy, heavy ammo for that. So I'd rather hold on to it if I can. Because like this one, it's kind of a pain in the butt. But that one is way more difficult from my memory. And again, I didn't remember no chase scene, so maybe my memory fails me. Who knocked her on her booty. Hey. Bam. Yeah. <laughs> can, we, can we knock her around? Oh no, she's stuck in that thing there. Alright, now she's dead. Oh, damn it. Damn it. The cat's personal data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been in power for decades. He's stronger than anything you've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the Council to work for him? You think I betrayed the Council? Like Saren? Go to hell. The Broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. Sounds like you sold so out. So if the Broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Tell yourself whatever you like. The Council would never accept you working for the Shadow Broker. The Council? You ditched them, played dead for two years, and came back working for terrorists. It's complicated. Do you have any idea what Cerberus has done? The Council wasn't looking out for human interests. Somebody had to. Human interests? I read the files, Shepard. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps. Hell, your own unit on a coos. And you're with them. Don't you dare judge me. Oh. Don't you. Uh. Dramatic death. <laughs> that was a little much. Sony have retrieved the data. Civilian casualties not a concern. Vizier's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to kill Farron. We won't give him time. We'll need the Normandy's stealth systems to get us in close undetected. The Shadow Broker's agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. What's the plan when we get there? Get in, get Farron, get out. And kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. They give me a lot of Paragon options here. But, you know, we're, we don't do Paragon options. We sit here, we get the job done. That's what we do. Let's uh, go back to... Well, no. Do I only get to add one? Really? Oh, okay. Well, it feels right to have Garrus, like I said before. So we're going to keep Garrus going. Um, I don't have enough points for that. Garrus ain't got nothing. Liara can get maxed out. So let's give her singularity. And uh, which one? Probably wide. Yeah, I like, I like wide singularity. We'll give her one point in warp. We'll break out her Asari scientists. And let's see here. Weapon damage goes up and power recharge. I'd rather have faster power recharge. So go with that. Um, let's give her a point in stasis and we'll, we'll get some warp points as well. Cool. Uh, do I need to mess with her weapons? Probably not. Pretty freaking cool. Pretty cool. Hagalaz, 
The oceans boil during the day, then snap freeze ten minutes after sundown. The Shadow Broker lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. How do we get inside? The shuttle bay is locked down. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. But we can't stay outside for long. There's a constant lightning storm where the hot and cold air collide. This is so cool. I point in this lightning, but absolutely I remember this from a communications array near the back of the ship. There's nothing below but maintenance equipment. We have to find an entrance near the back shielding. I forgot how freaking cool this was. 